What's up, Salmon Squad? I am the game Salmon, and welcome to Slendy Something. This is a game made by both Dave Microwaves Games and Micro Horror Arcade, focusing on Slender Man and other Slendy type characters. The game is broke up into several different levels in which I collect eight pages while dealing with some sort of Slendy type character, whether that be Slender Man or maybe a SpongeBob one or a Shrek one, I really don't know. We'll just have to play to find out. If you're excited to watch me play Slendy something, please be sure to like the video, subscribe, go follow me on Twitch, and leave a comment down below. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There are ten levels total? Really? This is a massive game. However, only the easy difficulty maps are available to us right now, so may as well start with Bebo Street, um, which is a small map. I was a small child the last time I was in the ASU, but I hear things have taken a turn for the worse. The Golden Boob Man was seen falling to his death a few years ago, but rumors that he has returned are floating around. I don't believe them, but there's only one way to find out. Go! Bebo Street awaits. Okie dokie, we have eight pages to collect. Let's go ahead and turn on our flashlight and start looking around here for pages. Now, what Slendy is going to be after me? Is it the Golden Boob Man, as it were? Is that the golden boob man becoming active? Hello? Mr. Golden Boob Man? Are you around? The, the game told me that the Slendy always knows where I am and to kind of slow him down I have to look at him, but if I look at him for too long, I will die. So, um, I, I mean, there's definitely gonna be some strategy at play here. So, learning these maps as quickly as possible going to help me out a lot. What does this say? I'm gonna grease you up real good. Okay, no thank you. Is, is that the golden boob man? Wait, what is that thing? No, I see it. I just... What are you? Okay, I'd like to go around you, please. You really don't look like anything. He looks angry though. This dude is actually really slow, which is very excellent for page collecting. You know, if I could find some more pages, I've been wandering around like an idiot trying to just search for something. Ah, oh, it's mom! Ah, there's one. Okay, with every page I collect, he gets faster. And I think this is the play. I kind of have to look at him and then look away, but then also look at him because, oh my God, <laughs> he gets faster if I, if I like don't look at him. Okay, wait, where, where is the exit out of this courtyard? Okay, there we go. I need to go. Stop it! No, 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 no! I'm alive! Oh my god! Oh my god! There we go. I've neglected to look at the trees. I need to make sure that I'm looking at every single angle of like every single object because all of these are actually really well hidden and it doesn't help that I don't exactly know where they are with a crazy man after me. The golden boob man who is not golden. Oh, there we go. All right, seven out of eight. I only need one more. I just don't know where that last one will be. <gasps> that's it, that's it, I beat it. You win, ha ha. Wow, big grats on escaping Bebo Street and surviving the onslaught of the golden boob man. Go to the extras menu and see what has been unlocked. Before I do that, I wanna see what the jump scare looks like. Hey there, Mr. Boob Man. Okay. Oh, there's a death count. Fantastic. Oh, wow. There's a lot to the extras. Okay, let's check out pages first. Oh, so here are all the pages for the Boob Man level. <laughs> okay. That's what the Golden Boob Man sounds like. Here we have the White Cathedral, which is a medium-sized map, but still on the easy difficulty. Mother Elizabeth was always a loose cannon, especially for someone who claimed to be so dedicated to her faith. We always assumed it was because she possessed an unusual personality and nothing more. Then the day came. It was ghastly. I'd never seen so much blood. I barely made it out alive. Just promise me you'll never go there. Never approach the White Cathedral. Mother Elizabeth, huh? All right, well, we have eight pages to collect. 
No, I, I actually really like this layout. Uh, might as well check the tombstones real quick. I'm betting that there's got to be one over here, right? I mean, it would just make sense. Or maybe there's not one over here. Okay. Oh, there's one. Found one. Found one in the courtyard. And click. There we go. One out of eight. Elizabeth is probably active. Oh, wow. Wait, there's a lot more in the back. Holy crap. Okay. Um... Oh god. Oh god, it's Elizabeth. Oh god, it's Elizabeth. Oh no, no, I see, I see a page. Elizabeth, no! Elizabeth, no! Oh, you look creepy. I don't like you. Oh, you are actually really creepy. I am just gonna dive into the Burning Cross Cathedral. Okay. I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan. Oh, there's one. Okay, three out of eight. She's starting to get faster. Oh, I was about to say, I, I, I thought I was in a dead end, but now we have this little maze of fencing going on? What is... Where is this leading me? I did not realize that there was so much to explore outside. There are way too many tombstones to explore. All right, well, there's, there's four out of eight. Hooray for me. Okay, yeah, she's way back there. I'm keeping her at bay, which is good. See how many we can collect before I die. Oh, these are interesting looking tombstones. They actually look like Cactuar from uh, Final Fantasy. Here's one. Five out of eight. <gasps> what the hell is that? Can I click on this? I found an Easter egg. It's Pickle Man. Stay back. Stay back, nun. I'm betting the other three may actually be in the cathedral. I mean, like, the cathedral looks enormous, but really there's not too much to explore. There's not many areas in the cathedral. Um, I know I can go, like, left and right, so let me... Uh, let's go to the, the right real quick. I might die. I should have gone in here in the first place. Oh my god! Ah! Ah! No! No, 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 no. I gotta go over here, too. Okay, all right, well, please, please tell me that there's something over here. Oh, there isn't? Fantastic, I went over here. For no reason, don't die! Oh my god, okay, let me just, oh god, oh god, dead end? No, not dead end, I can escape this way. Okay, we're okay. <laughs> wow, everything's pretty much outside. Here's one, here's one, collect it! No, don't die! <laughs> Six out of eight. Oh, I don't like you, Elizabeth. It seems like every time I load up the game, all the page locations are going to be different. Now, that helps with the replayability of the game. It does not help me survive. Because <laughs> I, I can't memorize where the locations of all the pages are. Which, I guess, is a good thing. It increases the challenge! Mm. Oh, it's, is that Nosferatu? I found an Easter egg! Don't kill me! Don't kill me! Don't kill me! Don't kill me! Where am I going? Ah, come on! It pains me because this is supposed to be an easy map. And yet, here I am dying like a doofus. Come on, come on, come on, there's one. All right, seven out of eight. Oh God, is this a dead end? Please tell me this isn't a dead end. It's not a dead end, but I am not, it's not looking good for me. It's not looking good, ladies and gentlemen. Oh God, oh God, I only need one more. One more to go. Where is it? There it is, I found it, I found it, I found it, I found it. Stay back, stay back, none, stay back. No, 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 I win, I win, I win, I win, I win, I win. You win! You have escaped the White Cathedral and the nun who haunts it. Good job! Head on over to the extras menu and see what has been unlocked. Rare Golden Boob Man. Oh. Oh, that's... Okay, the first boob man that I saw had... Well, it was blue, and so I didn't, I didn't realize that that was a rare golden boob man. This is the real golden boob man, and this is the rare golden boob man. I understand. And here is the nun. However, maybe there is a secret version of the nun. Here are all the pages that I just collected. You know, there is a lot to this game. I, I would imagine that at the end of this entire playthrough, I'll just run through all of the extras because there is a lot in the extras menu. Arg, Davy Jones Locker. Map size large, difficulty easy. Arg, the last thing I remember was the Captain Roaring Commands, trying his damnness to speak above the thunder of waves crashing against the ship. Then it all went black. When I woke, I thought me eyes were deceiving me. A shipwrecked isle with nothing but the blasted sea below and above. Davy Jones Locker. I really gotta work on my pirate accent. That was horrible.
Okay, zero out of eight pages here in Davy Jones' locker. And I'm assuming we're dealing with Davy Jones, and my god, this is actually going to be a pretty large map. I hope that there are no uh, pages on, like, random trees, because that would be very difficult for me to find all eight. Okay, Davy Jones laughs like that. That's horrifying. I'm not gonna worry too much about the trees. I'm just gonna go to like the large structures like the anchor or like this shipwrecked looking building and see if we can find any in here. Arg. Mr. David Jones, where are you? I'd like to see what you look like. Is that SpongeBob? Wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. Is that SpongeBob? I'm pretty sure that's SpongeBob. Wee -woo, wee -woo, wee -woo. All right, halfway there, four more to go. Oh, wait, 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 there's one. I do not see Davy Jones. I must have outran him or something. You are supposed to be like way back there, aren't you? Oh no, oh god, you're catching up. Never mind. Oh god, okay. Well, here's one on this um lighthouse. Okay, that's the word. <laughs> Alright, six out of eight. Two more. Let's see if we can knock this out. Hold the phone. Here's one. Okay, just need one more. I'm doing a pretty good job keeping him away thanks to the enormous map. There's plenty of places to run around. It gets a little dicey once I run into areas like this, but it's gonna be alright as long as I keep moving. Oh. I haven't been in here. Oh, it's gotta be in here. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. I have not been here before. Easter Island heads. Come on, Easter Island heads. Come on, Easter Island heads. Oh God, is this a dead end? Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. No, no SpongeBob, no! I felt really good about that. Oh, there we go, there we go, and done. Boom! You win! Arg, you managed to break free of the nightmare within Davy Jones' locker. Go to the extras menu and see what has been unlocked, you scallywags. Here we are with the pages that we collected from Davy Jones' locker. Uh, then we have the Slindy, which is Spongebob. And the only two Easter eggs that I have found so far came from the cathedral. And it actually makes me kind of want to go back and search for more Easter eggs. Okay, Micro Horror Arcade just told me that there are two Easter eggs and one rare character per level. So, time to do some hunting. Is this an Easter egg? Mm -hmm. Oh, that's an Easter egg. What is that referring to? Wait a minute, maybe that's a Nightmare on Sesame Street from Dave Microwave's games. <gasps> found it, found it. Mm. There we go, found the Easter egg. I know that sound. <gasps> I found an Easter egg! Wait, what is this? Ah, dancing crabs! Look at my dance! Oh, 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 what? Hello there. Are you what I'm looking for? Can I click you? Oh, hello there. Are you the Easter egg? There it is. Okay, now we got the Easter eggs. Slendy something. This is a fun game poking fun at all of the Slender clones that we've seen ever since Slenderman became an internet phenomenon. I was searching for a while for the rare nun until uh, Micro Horror Arcade said that, hey, you should probably collect all of the extras and then save the rare hunts for later because the more extras that I have, the easier it is for a rare monster to spawn. So we need to wait till like we get further in the game before we start rare hunting. But that doesn't stop me from getting the Easter eggs. We do have all the Easter eggs for like all the levels that we've gotten so far. There are two Easter eggs per level. That is going to be it for this video. I would love to play more, but I also want to make sure that it's content that you also want. So if you want me to play more of Slendy Something, please let me know by liking the video and leaving a comment down below. Thank you all so much for watching. Please be sure to click on the end card to the end of this video. Also be sure to like and subscribe if you have not already done so. Go out there and make someone's day. Be happy, stay happy, and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.